Hi, this is Al McGee. I'm here at the Fort Lauderdale International Film Festival party. We're having a great time. This is your entertainment ticket. Get us at www.yeticket.com. But I'm here with a very beautiful filmmaker. Her name is Dawn. Dawn, tell us about yourself and the name of the film you got here at the film festival. My name is Dawn Dubria. I'm a local filmmaker. I did the official video for the Florida Renaissance Festival, which is a great, fun documentary starring Bobby Rodriguez. And it screened uh, on Saturday, October 16th. Yeah, I know that. And uh, I saw it. That was pretty good. I, I really enjoyed it. And you like the Renaissance Festival and things like that, right? Yeah, it's, it's really a lot of fun. Yeah, but also, you're a filmmaker. So how did you get into films? Yes, this is true. Um, this year I screened a documentary, but my real passion is narrative films. I've been making films since my parents gave me a camera when I was 10 years old. We would shoot, cut, rewind. If they messed up, do it again. You hear me say, go. You know, for the action, we did all different kinds of genres. And then um, my camera broke, so I forgot about doing it for a while. I still have those films, by the way. My friends in middle school better watch out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so this is a passion for you. Films are a passion for you. So how are you enjoying the Fort Lauderdale International Film Festival? It's great. It's great to be immersed with so many like minds and local filmmakers. It's like being with Fort Lauderdale's elite right now. Yeah, that's right. It really is. Well, Don, what you got for the future? Well, um, I went to college at FAU for a film, and then I moved to LA and worked, um, went to Los Angeles Film School, and then worked on over 20 independent films, made a whole bunch of shorts of their um, various genre. And right now I'm in grad school. Mm. And um, thinking about my first feature, which is a cross between Working Girl and Bridget Jones. Wow, sounds like it's gonna be sexy Working Girl. Yeah. <laughs> I also have a huge passion for the Renaissance, and I'll be spending 10 weeks in Europe in summer 2011. Wow. So wait till you see the footage that I'm going to shoot over there and bring wow. back and screen next year at Pliff. Wow. <laughs> Man, that sounds fantastic. I, that sounds exciting. Well, thank you, Don. I'm really glad that you took the time to come here to the film festival here at the Fort Lauderdale International Film Festival, but also to be on YETicket.com. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Hey, and keep watching us every day and the day after. Hi, this is Paul Isaac from Your Entertainment Ticket. Come and see us every day at www.yeticket.com. We're here at the 25th Fort Lauderdale Film Festival, and I'm here with one of our local talents. This is, let me introduce you to Kenny Austin. That's right. Please tell us about your movie and um, the movie that you'll be having at the festival. Yeah, thank you very much. My movie is titled Glorious Journey. Um, it's the story of this lady, very nice lady that travels from Africa down here to the States to visit her brother. And upon arriving here, she realizes that he has been living a double life and he's not who he has been representing back home to be. And um, as the story unfolds, there are lots of twists and turns, lots of surprises. It's just a very, very enjoyable film, you know, a film that everybody can sit down and enjoy. It pretty much cuts across all genres. And uh, it's a story I wrote about eight months ago. And I started working on it right immediately after I finished writing it. And so far, so good. The response has been awesome, has been great. Great. Is this uh, your first uh, feature? Is it a feature or a short film? Um, it's a short at the moment, but mm -hmm. we are currently filming the feature and it's going to be out on video on demand by the end of this year. Oh, beautiful. And um, is there a, a website or somewhere we can find you? Oh, yeah, absolutely. You can go to my website, at, which is mxistudios.com slash Glorious Journey. And I'm also on Facebook as well. And you can get to see lots of clips from the film. You can actually watch the whole short version of it right on my website. And you can also see behind the scenes pictures as well, production notes. And there's also an IMDb page as well that you can get as much information about the, about the film as possible. Beautiful. And we're very excited. Can you tell us a little bit when the movie is uh, featuring at the festival? Um, it actually screened already last week oh, to okay. a very, very, you know, to, I mean, it was well received. Mm -hmm. it, was, it screened at Cinema Paradiso in Fort Lauderdale last week. Mm -hmm. And we're hoping for a second screening sometime in early November. That's wonderful. I'm sure a lot of people will be interested to see it. Yeah. And uh, thank you for being with us. Just a few last words about future projects coming up. Is there anything? Oh yeah, um, I have a few movies I'm working on right now. My latest film title, Closure, it's going to be released in um, early November. It's, it's a psychological thriller and it promises to be very exciting. So besides that, I also have lots of other stories I'm working on because I'm always writing. I never stop writing. So 
yeah, I, I'm quite busy. I, you know. You're a writer, director, you're a renaissance man of, of today and you do it all. So that's wonderful. Yeah, it's fun yeah. to do it all. Absolutely. Okay. Well, thank you very much. This is Paula Isaac. I'm here with uh, Kenny Austin at the Film Festival. And come and see us every day at www.yeticket.com. Thank you. Hi, uh, we're at the Fort Lauderdale Film Festival talking with the director of an interestingly titled film. Fanny, Annie, and Danny. Fanny, Annie, and Danny. Not Danny, Annie, and Fanny, or Fanny, Annie, Danny, 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 Ann. Man, I'm lost in <laughs> it already. That's a different film. That's it a is. different film. Not well, let's good. talk about your film. Your name is Chris. I, my name is Chris Brown. And Jill. Pixley. Who are married and are a producing, directing team. I assume producing and directing. Uh, directing and... and uh, acting uh, also. Yeah, acting. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so even all. better. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so tell me about your film. Well, the film is uh, about a bad family Christmas. And it's about three adult siblings who are forced back together by their mother to endure a Christmas celebration. This is a heavy drama, I well, take it. Well, yeah, it's not so heavy. I mean, it's a, some people, we've, we've actually had, not fights, but There's pretty heated. There's been controversy yeah. at, at screenings as to, is it comedy, is it drama? Yeah. Is do hype? people laugh? Oh, they do. laugh. Then yes. it's a comedy. We love okay. it when they laugh. All right. yeah. Yeah. Or a comedy, yeah. a, a, a drama, Dramedy dramedy. or yeah. I think it's called a boo-hoo-ha. A boo-hoo-ha-ha? Boo wow. Boo-hoo-ha-ha. -ha. <laughs> really? I never heard I'm, that no, one No, I before. just made it up. That's, That's good. good. We should, uh, we'll That's pass it now. Right, <laughs> right there. You've heard but it here first. Some people cry, some people laugh, but it's 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 sort of an intense, you know, what you yeah, right. What you feel at Thanksgiving is what you may feel upon seeing this movie. But you should see it anyway. Well, what if you feel good things about Thanksgiving? You should see it anyway. That's, that's fair, too. So and there's, is, there's a little bit of good. What's it like working together as a team? It can be a little <laughs> challenging. challenging. Yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's definitely 24-7. You know, we don't leave the, the job at work. We live it all the time. Um, but we're a very small unit as far as the, the crew, the whole production was very small. So it's yeah. it's almost like the whole cast kind of becomes the family and Absolutely. the crew. It was such a small yeah. unit. So and You guys are based in San Francisco? San Francisco, right. right, right we right, actually right. met. You know, I cast Jill in my first feature. Right. That's how we so met. We've and we've since gotten married. God, and it then was, was the uh, Well, it was. It was yeah, the, it was. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so yeah. this is the first one that we've done. As I roped and Jill into this yes. movie. How did you? How did I was going to ask you yeah. that? How did this come about? He just wrote the Jeez. script and handed it to me and said, "Here, read the part of Fanny." I, I had no idea what the movie was about. He's very secretive when he's in the writing process. Mm. He kind of goes in the closet and just writes, right. and I don't really it's know his closet. I know. Came window. out of the closet yeah, yes, to make the film. That's see, see, that's, that's how yeah. much I care about cinema. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, he just handed it and said here, and then you know a few weeks later we were shooting. It was it was That's a really pretty true. quick production yeah. schedule. It That's really was. It sounds yeah. interesting. It sounds yeah. like you guys have the pulse on this thing. So. You're going to yeah. be there Sunday at 2:45 at the right. Cinema Paradiso. Cinema Paradiso. I, hope not. I wouldn't miss that for the Don't world. Don't miss it. And neither should you guys. Please come. We'll be there. Okay. So from us to you, this is. Uh, a Chris happy Brown, Christmas. Fanny, <laughs> Annie, and Danny. 2.45. Fanny, Annie, and Danny. 2.45 right. Sunday afternoon. Come on down, y'all. Christmas is around the corner. Y'all? <laughs> That's a southern thing. You're a, you're a western guy. I've uh, <laughs> got a lot of southern roots. Yeah. <laughs> Take care. He's got the we'll roots. see you again. <laughs>